my name is Shelly Mopo Mama and welcome to my channel. So today we've got my favourite, favourite thing to do. I know, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I want to be deeper. I want to be a deep person, but I can't help it. I love a Primark haul. Yay! It's nothing so much, so much fun as going to Primark and seeing all these lovely things that you feel like you couldn't afford if you went shopping elsewhere. Oh, it's brilliant. So, so yeah. So I went to Leeds the other day on a little trip. So I was going out for a lunch with Honest Mum. So I was that. I just hung around and there's kind of blogging, blogging circles, which I don't normally, but she'd organised a really nice lunch. So went along, had a great time. And I thought, well, since I'm going there, I might as well go a bit earlier and just have a little peep in Primark, just have a little shop. Now I did take the two smalls with me. So it wasn't just a fun little shop. It was a chaos, but you know, I managed to fill a basket still. Results. So, I didn't just buy, though, I didn't just buy some stuff. I bought life changers. So when, I, when I'm shopping, I'm not going to just buy some stuff, you know, some clothes and some hair. I'm going for dreams. I'm buying the dream. Every single item has been chosen specifically to make an ultimate change in my life, to make it a better life. That is the power of shopping. Don't ever underestimate the power of shopping because it's magic it's magic anyway let's get on with it because oh, i've got some really cool stuff in here okay so start with hairbrush a bamboo large round hairbrush four pounds very nice it's because all the children scream when i brush their hair every morning so with these kind of bristly ones it'll just hopefully won't hurt as much it looks nice as well because you need to pay about 20 pounds for a brush like that very pleasing. Now, so, so I spend a lot of time in my bedroom, in my bed, because I kind of sleep with the children and I take them up when I go up. So I take them up about eight o'clock and I usually work from bed then. And I've always slept with no clothes on. I know, exotic, eh? But yes, I've always slept with no clothes on. But as I'm getting, as my children are getting older, it's starting to feel, I'm just like, if anyone has any hint of a bit of skin with my son around, it's like, oh, mum, it's so disgusting, oh. <sighs> it's, it's not nice. So, bought myself some jammies. I don't know I have jammies. But look, look at these. Ooh. These are snazzy, aren't they? These are very nice. Silky. These are £7. And in this kind of blush pink that is everywhere at the moment. Now, I'd just like to say something about blush pink. It's very fashionable at the moment, but about 20 years ago, I remember coveting blush pink things at nightwear, that kind of thing. It was kind of a vintage style, and it was so hard to get hold of. So I'm jumping all over this trend because, you know, I'm not jumping on a trend. I've always liked it. I just haven't been able to get it. So, so when it was, so this week when it was in Primark, it was blush pink everywhere. I was like, yes. Finally! So it's taken 20 years to get everything I wanted. Exotic, exotic at my house. And I got a matching top. I actually wanted like a, a pyjama shirt, but I didn't seem to have any of those. So I got this little number instead. So I'll just be slinking around the house in my shiny jammers. Woo! Very nice, very nice. Our underwear now, I keep buying these special soft brow underwear things. <laughs> I keep buying them because none of them fit me. <laughs> so <laughs> I tried again. Now this is a little, it's a little set. This is really nice, and that's five pound. Now what I actually like about this mouse is, this might be too much information, probably is, but and I, my, I've got little fat bits by my ribs. I've got little fat bits, and you know, like, even I'm holding my stomach in, I'm looking down and going, "Oh, what are those fat bits? I'm not keen on them." So there's a little bit of frilliness to cover it. So I'm thinking, "Ooh." Those little fat bits, until I manage to get rid of them somehow, like my liposuction, then I'll be able to just cover them up with these little frilly bits. So I thought, hmm, nice, I'll give that a go. So I've got that. I've got, I've got another bra. I've got loads of bra. I'm getting really carried away with bras. And the problem is, because I keep buying them wrong, I just end up wearing the same old breastfeeding bra again and again and again. It's like, hopefully one of these is going to fit me nicely. See, the hardest thing is sizing in Primark. I think things are sized for really young skinny girls and I'm not really a young skinny girl unfortunately 
Um, so, yes, I've got this as well. Look at that. Really soft. Again, it's that kind of vintagey kind of blush pink, which I really love. So, hopefully this is going to fit. Now, I've got a size larger than I normally do. Because between me and you, one side's a bit bigger than the other. So, I have to cater for the bigger because I find otherwise. I'm leaning forward and like, oh, boobs out. That is not what I want. But anyway, yeah. <laughs> so, hopefully that's going to look lovely. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna do a try on for that because it might be a bit much. Oh, and I got some matching knickers for that as well. Uh, so the knickers, oh I don't know how much the knickers were, but nice, like French those French knickers. I really like those as well. They're really they're very sophisticated. Um, so, and that brow was five pounds. And then oh, what did I get next? Okay. So then I saw this necklace. Now, I never wear necklaces. I very occasionally buy them. I, never wear them. I saw them and I thought, ooh, maybe I need to try a necklace. Maybe that's what's missing from my ensemble. <laughs> Apart from the style and class, and <laughs> etc. Yes, it's a nice little kind of one. It was £3, which is a bargain. And it's just going to fasten them about like that. So that might give that a go. And then I've got some leggings. £2.50 leggings, you can't go wrong, £2.50 actually you probably can, they're probably really off. You never know. I'm not going to pay more than £2.50 if I can get £2.50 leggings. Not made of money. And then, okay, so I went for clothes. I've got managed to get myself a little outfit, so I've got this. The Rolling Stones t-shirt. I am a big fan of the Rolling Stones. But I kind of got it because my next item, I was a bit worried if it was a bit, a bit too granny-like. So I thought, funk it up with a funky t-shirt and it might look okay. Uh, and that was £8. Um, it's quite long as well, it's quite long, so you don't have to worry about, you know, a bit of belly sticking out when you reach up too high, because that's always a bit annoying, isn't it? Uh, I've got a couple of t-shirts, just kind of soft t-shirts. Uh, I've got another one. Where? And then this is the skirt that I got, so I might do a show on the t with the skirt and the top. We'll see. We'll see how it looks. We'll see how it looks first. It look hideous. And so I got this. This is like pleated skirt. I've seen a few vloggers do this, show their pleated skirts. I was just like, oh my gosh. I saw one one lady do it. And I was just like, right, that's it. That's that confirmed. I must go to Primark and have a look. So yes, yeah, so I got this one. So I was going to choose the grey, but then I saw this. I thought, well, this is that colour. So I've gone for this one, and it's in a kind of soft jersey material, like a t-shirt material, and that was eight pounds. Yeah, so yeah, that's the thing. This is the thing that I was worried about might look like an old lady. So we'll see. We'll see how I manage to jazz it up. I might just look insane as usual. Won't be anything new. Oh, this is a quiet toy. <laughs> also, known as a shut up now, please toy. This is my smallest. Is it that very special A where where you always go, ooh, you're getting ready for the terrible twos, aren't you? Everything I do is wrong. She went to hold the basket, she went to push the basket, she didn't actually want me to put anything in the basket. I wonder if her dad had taught that. Hmm. Yeah, so we had lots of fun. So here is Alice's shop now, please toy. And then because I was going out for the meal and I wanted to pretend that I was a good parent, I had to rush and get some colouring things. So I've got a little colouring book and some pens which I put in my Gorgeous new pencil case, lifestyle love. It's gonna Instagram perfect kind of one. So I look like a proper real cool person. Yeah, it's in some pens. So were, uh, it was £1.50 for the pens and colouring book. The, the cost of looking like a good parent though, priceless. And I'll spoil it though by admitting it since I got there. <laughs> so, oh, I got these so I could look like a good parent. Oh, good parents don't do that though, do they? They just go, oh yeah, this is just what I do. I'm just that kind of cool. And got some sunglasses. Ooh. Don't look quite as crazy as my sunglasses that I normally like. But they were three pounds and I was just like, oh, sunglasses, I need those. Yeah, because it's so blooming sunny around here. <laughs> yeah. It's for when I'm a star. I'll just put on my sunglasses, yes. I'm, I'm too starry to look you in the eye. <laughs> then, oh, I was in the stationery department again. Got this. Oh, this is another one. Instagram pictures. Unfortunately, they always end up as me, kind of putting weird faces. Really, I should be taking pictures of my marble look notebook. Ooh, lovely. £2.50. Literally bought that just so I could look as if I was fancy. Oh, 
What have I turned into? <laughs> Some things. So I've got one of these power bank things um, for charging your phone, and it will also charge my camera when I'm out about. I never remember to charge it up in, enough in time. Uh, six pounds, so well worth that. Good, nice size to my bag. Jolly good. Oh, I've got this little tripod thing. I've not tried these sort before, but I know it was cheaper than the one that I've been looking at. So. So it's probably rubbish, probably really rubbish. <laughs> Four pounds. Actually, it's more than the one that I'd last time got one from the pound shop last time. When you get a pound shop one, you get a pound shop one. <laughs> the legs fall down again and again and again. So yeah, so it's just looking at one with wiggly legs. So I'll just see how that is. Now it fits in my bag as well, so that's just one with this. Oh, oh, oh! Now I've been going to anthropology a lot and admiring a headband. And this headband was £32, like £32 for a headband. And then I went back at Christmas after the Christmas sale. Like, is it cheap? Is it cheap? Oh, yeah, it's cheap. £30. How can you pay that much for a headband? And then I discovered that nobody ever did any copies. I was looking all over for a copy of this anthropology headband. Couldn't find one anywhere. Until now. It's very exciting. Oh, so you can't see because I've got this thing here. Let me smooth this thing. Right. Okay. So. So, I got this. Ooh, lovely. Lovely. Especially lovely because it was £3 instead of £32. It's nice, isn't it? It's nice. They only have this kind of style. It was so nice. I bought one for my sister as well. So, she can look forward to having one. I'm going to match on. No, we're going to be those sisters that, with the matching headbands. I, I, must, I must write to you. You must only wear this when I'm not there with you. Oh, we're going to end up wearing this together, I can just tell. But yeah, really pleased with this because I've been looking for a headband that actually looks good for so long and I, I never get it right, I never get it right. So I am liking this a lot. Now, <laughs> now and part of my dream, the dream that I was buying, I'm going to be a bit fit, do you remember me saying a while ago, I'm going to be outside more, I might do a bit of running and I have actually signed up for a charity run which I really, really keep forgetting. But you know, I'm so last minute, I'll be like, yeah, I'm going to train the week before, that's definitely what I'm going to do. So, to get ready for the dream, I got these, woo! Ah, Charlotte must be fun running in these. Now you see, my plan was, when my running, that I wouldn't get running clothes, because you know, it's a bit of an effort, go and get your running clothes on, blah, blah, blah. how about you just have running clothes on, all, you just have trainers on with your normal clothes, and then I'll just run everywhere. That's what I'll do, I'll just be running everywhere. I definitely will. But anyway, yeah, snazzy, yeah, I like this a lot, I like this a lot. So I'm very pleased with this. And, ooh, I've got a picture, I do love the homewares department. Oh my gosh, it's amazing, the bedding, so much nice bedding. I can't buy any more bedding because I've got nice bedding at the moment. Uh, but yes, i got this. So this is nice, this is it positive mind, positive vibes, positive life. And this is another life changer, because I'm going to have this in my fireplace, and every time I look at it, I'm going to go, yeah. I'm positive. So it's not just a picture. It's a life changer. Do you remember that? So yes, that'll be good for my fireplace. Oh, and I've got these in the homeware department. So these are nice. Oh, can you see them? So you might have to take them out of the box. But these are six pounds. Every time I go, I buy fairy lights. Because they're just, they're just so good. They're just so good, they're fairy lights. They just they look expensive as well. They look... Now oh, look at these. How cool are they? Six pound. I think they're really good. I'm very pleased with them because they just they, look, they don't look Primark today. They look a bit, they look a bit TK Maxx. But yeah, they just look. I really like them anyway. So I'm not sure where they're going to go yet, but I'll let you know when I do. So get on. It's got a little nail varnish, a nude one. Fancy, isn't it? It's a fancy, it's a sophisticated colour, and I don't really wear nail varnish that often because it's just because it takes too long to dry. I really like the fast drying stuff, but 90p, you know, for a nude one, worth a go. And then finally, from a Primark haul, this beauty. Now I was getting to the end of it. I got out and paid for my stuff, and I was on my way out, and then I saw it, and I was like, I think I might have to go back to that. This is another life changer. This is going to make me. It's like, it's a little bit towy. Now, I'm, I'm not sure if I would need to be aiming for towy kind of look, but it's a bit sophisticated. It says, I'm a stylish woman. It also says, I'm 
into my fitness. I'm looking after my body. Look at this. Ooh. I'm not going to show you with this on. Well, I might do it. No, no, I won't show you with this on. Yeah. Nice, isn't it? 13 pounds. Built-in support. It's got a little bit of padding around the chest area as well. Which, you know, I always go for padding around the chest area. Do you know why? Because nipples are your source of warm. You ever notice if you don't wear a bra, you're chilly. You're blooming chilly. So I like to always have something on my nipples. I'm buying the dream. I'm buying myself. Sat next to some beautiful pool. Somewhere gorgeous. My body's all fit. I'm looking amazing. I'm wearing this. And that is what I bought from Prime. That's the kind of thing. This is priceless. These are priceless things. You know. To be able to give someone the gift of that dream. Oof. Oof. Anyway. <laughs> so, hope you like my haul. I've also got a few little bit more things that I'm going to show you. Now, these are things that I bought the other day that just arrived. So, I thought I might as well chuck them in the lock. They're good. You, you like to see these. No. It's still in the bag. It's that good. So I'm saving it. I don't, when things come, I don't get them out until I've shown you. Because once I've got them out, that's it, they're gone. Yeah, look at this now. Look at this dress. Ooh. This is a shirt dress. The belt. It's nice, isn't it? Now, this is, this is from Matalan. And it was only £16. And it was actually, I got an email. Um, and it's recommended by Giovanni Fletcher. You know, who does the Happy Mum book. Now, it turns out I'm seeing her on Friday. Uh, we're going to a special thing. And I'm just really hoping she doesn't wear the dress that she she won't. She'll be wearing some luxury designer item. Imagine though, imagine if she's wearing the dress that she recommended from Matalan and we're there matching. <gasps> oh, how embarrassing. Yeah, and then so if you if you spend it over a certain amount, you've got free delivery. So I was just like searching for other items and then I saw this and I was just like, ooh. Maybe it's time I got a proper bag. Okay. So there's a new bag, and that's £14. Nice. It's got a strap, it's got handles. You see, it's a long time since I've had a kind of proper lady bag. Uh, so, yes, I might wear this on Friday. And it actually matches my camera as well, because I've got a little special case. You can see. can't see my actual camera because we're looking at it, but yeah. Look, it's a matching. It looks nice. I like the kind of look. I like these kind of things as well because they look a lot more expensive than they are. <sighs> I'm so shallow. I'm very sorry. I'm just so shallow. But yeah, and this bird. I might, should I put some pom poms on it? That's what they do with the cool. Ooh, I'm not quite sure if I can pull the pom poms. And I got this. Ooh, finally. I've got some more of my special bedding. You see this bed in here, then this bed in here. I waited, I waited for about two months in some sort of email waiting list to get this bed in because it sells out. So I got it finally. And then they just sold out again straight away and I want some more for when my husband finally gets his bed. You're going to see this next week. The super bed, you're going to love it. But he's getting a double and it's going to be added onto king size to make the amazing bed. But I was like, oh, I want the matching bed in. I want, I want the look. Anyway, I managed to find it in a double. So, yeah, so look, so it's 180 thread count, uh, 20 pounds, which is a really good price. It's, this bedding is so nice, so, so nice. Yeah, oh, you can see a picture of it there. A dream of my bedroom looking like this in the background. Unfortunately, it doesn't, but never mind. Thanks for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. And don't forget, if you want to subscribe, just pop your, press the button, I can hear her here. And I'll see you next time. Bye.